a bit of a hectic game today, but a win nonetheless. What's your thoughts on the game? Uh, I think it's a typical pre-season game. Um, you know, it's good to finally get back on the front pitch after you know, a good week of training sessions. Um, you know, um, it's good to see you. boys back again, getting into that like, match rhythm. You know, just slowly getting into it again. Um, but I think, yeah, you know, there's some good performances out there. And um, no, we're just stepping on, you know, it's all part of, you know, getting fit, you know, being ready for the new season. So obviously it's the first game with a number of the first team boys coming back into the into the squad, including Kevin Locko. Good to see him on the pitch and good to see you guys back out there doing your thing. Yeah, I think Kev was, uh, you know, I know, I, I see he was good, but obviously, you know, Casino Five Balls, but no, he's, he's a, you know, established nationally, you know, player and, um, you know, he earned his uh, move to Harrogate and, you know, to come here, he's got his experience, and uh, hopefully, you know, he can bring that on with the um, young boys and even the team. Um, he's a leader. Um, yeah, and I think he, he performed. To be fair, I think um, it's, it's, I don't think the score matters in this kind of games. I think it's just about getting the, the minutes in and slowly, you know, building up and getting ready for the start of the new season. But you know, um, it's good to play in front of the fans again, which is you know a key um, thing. It's good to see new, uh, new faces and old faces. Um, around the pitch but um, no, as I said it's, it's, it's a step in the right direction. What does matter is striker scoring goals, you've got three of those today, I know you'll say it's a pre-season game but it's good to get off the mark and get in the goal scoring group nonetheless. Uh, yeah obviously you know, as a striker you always want to be scoring goals whatever you know competition or friendly or whatever it is but um, you know, that's what we're there for um, but yeah no uh, I think um, there's some good there was some good performances out there you know especially when you know Tommy was playing with me today um, I thought he's really good, you know, running behind, and uh, you know, it's just, for him, that's a, this is a new step for him. You know, he's playing first team football and seeing how it's like. And hopefully, some good, valuable experience for the young kids as well. And obviously, for us, as I said, it's uh, part of um, you know our, our goal. You know, trying to be uh, as top and as fit as we can be. Uh, for the start of the new season. Let's talk about the youngsters a little bit more. Obviously, you've got Alfie who started the game. You've got George who came on. Obviously, Ryan in goal. So a number of players who are starting to, you know, come through and really want to fight for that place in the starting lineup. Yeah, um, you know, I've seen them now last week, and some, some of them is the first time I've seen them this week, and uh, you know, I'm really impressed. You know, and I think there's there's no lie that you know the academy's got some really really good players, um, and uh, that are bringing up. You know, I think. The past t uh, speaks for itself, and um, yeah, uh, hopefully now they can get some valuable minutes in pre-season, and hopefully they, you know, they do well enough, which I'm sure they can be. They got very good potential. They'll be involved with the first team because they're not as big as they're going to be uh, this season. Because another one of those was a Harvey Walker, and of course, you know, you've scored your hat trick. He's won the penalty, and like we said it off camera, you know, you've given it to him. It's his chance to score in front of the fans for the first time. A hundred percent, he he earned that penalty. You know. Um, he done so well to go past, you know, using his lightning speed pace to go past the defender, and you know, it's, the defenders only had to go and take him out. So, you know, I, I think, you know, as a kid, because I remember it myself, you know, it's a valuable experience, and you know, to even just get off the mark, especially as a youngster, it gives you that like, little green confidence. And I've seen the potential of Harvey doing his doing a week, and he's you know, hell of a player, and um, uh, I believe that like, he's got so much ahead of him if he puts his head in the right place and everything. I think it'll be, it'll be doing very well. Let's talk about the fans a little bit. Obviously, just over 600 here today. It's, it must be great for you to have them back here and cheering you on. Oh, I don't think I've got to speak too much about them. You know, uh, the fans of the ledge, one of, as I said to you, one of the reasons why I, you know, I signed this season again was because the fans, you know, I want that to be part, part of that again, you know, being in front of the East Bank. And um, yeah, no, I'm looking forward to them. It's, it's lovely to see some of, some of the new and old faces today. Um, you know, uh, no, very happy to see them back in, you know, and obviously we've got a couple more weeks of games and um, hopefully we can see more of them, you know, as slowly as and hopefully getting ready for the first game of the season. And we're back here again for the next game pre-season, Sutton recently promoted. It'll be a tough game, but, you know, an important one nonetheless. Oh, yeah, you know, uh, Sutton done very well last season, you know, winning the league. Um, you know, they have a principal way they play and, uh, you know, it's another good test for us, you know, and, you know, it's, as I said, like sometimes pre-season is not all about a result, you know, but um, it's good to test ourselves against good oppositions and, you know, something are definitely good, very good opposition and, um, yeah, we're looking forward to it. Are you in with a shot? More information in the description below. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.